All right, Lady Isox, a few other general principles to talk about. One is having your body and stick between the other player and your net. And this is especially important in the defensive end because we want to limit the amount of shots, especially good quality shots, that they get on our goalie. And so one example, if this is their center woman, this is our defense woman here, right? Say they're coming up and they're trying to kind of find an open lane. If we stay up here, all of a sudden, look, there's this lane for a shot or to skate past you for almost a little breakaway here. And so we typically want to, number one, attack, uh, and secondly, be in between your goalie and their player. Now, that being said, we don't want you to back into our net. That's why forcing the puck and pressuring the puck is so important when you're that first person closest to it, okay? But in general, you want to stay in between their player, right, and our goal, okay? So, for example, too, if you get out of position and you're up there, well, they have a nice lane to either pass it, right, into their other player here for a shot, or they can skate it, right? Versus if you're here with your stick on the ice and stick on the puck, it's a lot more difficult for them. And that's the point, is to make it difficult for the other team and force them to make little errors so that we will get the puck back.